Watu juzi ni semi na baki top MC kuchocho na femu wana do the most Kwa mpola utakutema madoba zikanda kuflop Keshwa 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 Kinyo na kwa street Nipe Hey, nipe, nipe heshma. What's happening, beautiful people? You are tuned into the Woman Take Over Wednesday show and I am so excited. I am so thrilled. Yani, you guys do not understand. I have Wanjiko Kimani, but you guys know her as Femi Uno, Femi One. She's a FMC, she's a rapper, she's a singer, she's a poet, she's an actress, she's a fempreneur. She is a woman and she is making moves out here. And it is only right to have her here on my my show the woman take over Wednesday show Femi Uno yes oh my god <laughs> <laughs> thank you so so much for coming and gracing us with your presence thank you so much for having me ah uh, mm. man you don't even know i am such a fan thank Le- you uh your birthday is on the 25th yes it is coming right up it is it <laughs> is um I'm having a show on the 29th. Uh-huh. So I'll be doing rehearsals, I'll be kidogo busy. Mm-hmm. Uh but I'm also not very big on birthdays. I do, I was actually thinking about it the other day. Really? Yeah. Nico 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 so much into into working mm-hmm. and building. Um mm-hmm. I n- I really need to take some time off. Yeah. Yeah. Probably not not this year mm-hmm. or uh not uh on my birthday, mm-hmm. but I definitely will. Nice. Mm. Eh, you definitely need a break. Yeah. It is we all do. Yeah. Yes. Let me tell you, rest mm. is just as important as hustling. True. And I feel like you really hustle and you've been yeah. in this industry for like ten years. Yes. Let me tell you guys, you don't know what this woman is doing out there. You are making history. I know mm-hmm. and I was actually listening to my it sounds it's in a sound cocky but anyway <laughs> I would tell us <laughs> I was listening to my EP today and mm-hmm. I was having a conversation with someone and I was like yo manzi ee EP ni noma yo ee EP ni noma and I really feel like people will will uh, the day I I decide to hang the boots mm-hmm. like mtani miss mtani miss and um in in a few years to come people might might not uh acknowledge or see the impact of what i'm doing right now mm. but najua in a few years watu watakuwa like yo kulikuwa ngana mdemo anaitwa Femi One and she did this and this and this and she achieved this and that i was actually thinking about it today like whatever i'm doing now mm-hmm. it's very impactful yo very preach yeah dem kutoka mwiki yes <laughs> Tell us about how that was being raised in Wiki. Ebu tuambie hiyo story. Ah, uh, kulelewa Wiki. I've mm. been raised by a single mom. Mm-hmm. Our dad died a uh, kitambo tukiwa wadogo. Mm-hmm. I have a big bro, a sister and then mimi ndio last born. Mm. Uh, so mimi ndio nili nilizaliwa Wiki. I was born in Wiki, born and raised. I went to primary school in Wiki. Um and then Nilianza kurap nikiwa mwiki still in in school mm-hmm. there was this friend of mine and it was Samantha uh, Samantha alikuwa na rap mm. alikuwa na rap and she was in this group called Islandos so uh, ali transfer kutoka shule aka join shule yetu but tulikuwa tunajuana like kutoka mtaani eh. yeah so nikamwambia like Samantha mimi na pia mimi rap akaniambia you, you know niko na niko in this group that uh, sisi uenda on Saturday mm-hmm. on Saturday and Sunday i could uh, tunaweza enda pamoja introduce you to the guys yeah. and that's how my musical journey started so tulikuwa tunaenda British Council. Uh, mm. watu wa Upper Hill if if you know you know British yeah. Council. Yes. Um there was this event ilikuwa inaitwa Wapi Words and Pictures. Mm. So rappers tuliko tunaenda huko poets wasewa graffiti. Yeah. It was a very huge platform. That's where uh, many rappers came up akina Kali, akina Octo, mm. like tulikuwa sisi wote tulikuwa tuna we used to share that stage that platform. Yes. And um upon your akina kaka waliniona mm-hmm. and that's how i got uh, sent to kaka empire but anyway let's go back to to me growing up growing in up Wiki. in Wiki. yeah yeah uh, so this year uh, we are taking a very different direction with my brand okay uh, we introduced one for one mm-hmm. one for one which is uh, it's, it's my foundation yes i was actually going to ask about that yeah <laughs> <laughs> okay so tell me about one for one 
I've even stopped you but mm-hmm. it's amazing how you're taking a turn with the brand because I yeah. did want to ask you about mm. that please mm. tell us uh, uh, it's because I right now I feel I'm in a position to give back mm-hmm. like uh nikona nikona experience nikona resources yeah. so niko in a position to give back and I've always wanted uh to give back mm. uh so so that's why one for one uh one for one foundation is for is for people like me wase wale wase wamelelewa from from uh, backgrounds hawajiwezi mm. ama wako na potential ya kukuwa artist ama mm-hmm. kukuwa footballer ama ku- kuendelea na education but they don't have uh, the resources mm-hmm. so that's where uh, one for one comes in yes and um my first visit we actually went back to Mwiki to my former primary school and we gave uh tukapatiana pads and nice. tukapatiana soaps to the boys mm. because it's it's a primary school it's girls and boys okay. and also uh to have a session with the teachers and the students to get to understand what they need more mm. uh, because it's a public school you can imagine like kwa class moja wako students kama 600 Yo. Like yeah that's a lot, that's a lot. like uh, the textbooks probably see enough mm. uh, so to li, to li get to know what they need more yeah uh, and we will go back mm. we will go back and also to li and uh, Kayole we went to some school in Kayole mm-hmm. and uh, some sc- uh, school peer in Madare mm-hmm. uh, so that's what we've been doing with one for one yeah and also dem kutoka mwiki is also part of the project of giving back mm. um see necessarily like uh giving back by sharing my experiences yeah experiences as an artist like kuatel kutel venye nili grow up in mwiki as an artist uh, of course the community kuni support nilianzia church by the way ulianzia church nilianzia church for real <laughs> nilianzia... ulikuwa kwaya nilikuwa siko kwa kwaya uh-huh. nilikuwa na dance kwa church and surprisingly <laughs> ebu guess uliko tendeo hiyo church na nani na nani ebu niambie guardian angel for real hey! no guardian angel and dani gift What? I'm not sure if you if you know Danny Gift. No, I don't know Gift. Danny Gift, but Danny Gift uh, kona, she's uh, he's a very good singer. Very wow. very good very good singer. But nyinyi wote mnajua Guardian Angel. Yeah. Shout out to Guardian Angel Manze. Mm. The enemy is poverty. Lazima tuondoke poverty by all means. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. <laughs> yeah. So tuli tulianza na kina Guardian Angel in Mwiki Deliverance Church. Wow. Yeah. That's incredible. Mm. So here we have this fire as EP with. So I was streaming and I was like this is incredible. Mm. I listened to a couple of songs when I was heading there yeah. and I really really love the project. I love Heshma and I was like Thank you. yo I can definitely relate to this. Mm. Now Dem Kutoka Mwiki is what it's called. Yeah. And what I want to be able to do on my show today, kidogo different, I want you to take us on this journey of your EP. Mm. So I want us to go through the EP. Mm. We talk about the cover art. Mm. Let's talk about the producers. Yeah. Please put me in your shoes. Please put me in your studio when you are writing. Yeah. Because I want to fully immerse and mm. I want the listeners to also immerse themselves in your music. Surprisingly uh tulikuwa kwa studio na kina uh, king kaka I'm not sure hata kama anaweza kumbuka mm-hmm. and this was sometime last year and ali mention to ali mention juju akasema eh hey, manzi unafofanya project mm-hmm. uite 17b mm-hmm. ama uite kasarani mwiki or something and nikaeka at the back of my mind nikasema oh this is something this is something neza pick kitu mm-hmm. uh, so when i decided to do an ep and i wanted to do a fully hip hop ep kwa sababu i feel i'm um, in my rapping era so um mm-hmm. nika decide let me let me just uh, call the ep dem kutoka mwiki yeah. and uh and tell my experience as dem kutoka and also i just want uh nataka madam out there when you are kama kama mwiki ama islands mm-hmm. or you like unaweza unaweza zaliwa islands but you can become you can someone you know it. Yes. Uh, it doesn't matter mali ume, umezaliwa mm-hmm. it doesn't matter whether you are you are, you are speaking in swahili ama mm-hmm. english ama sheng mm-hmm. just be yourself wase wataku like tu venye uko manze just put yourself out there yeah. and people will love you for who you are so hiyo pia ndio message nilikuwa nataka ku put out there mm. and uh, the tracks kuko na heshma 
Yes. Which nearly shoot ya mwiki. Yes, I saw that the video is incredible. I was <laughs> like was. I can really resonate with the song. Yeah, I, we really had fun uh shooting the video. Yes. My brother was there. Yeah. Yendo alikuwa yani ana ana take care of everything. He was the security. <laughs> Ali tuletea match. Yani he did everything. everything. A very big shout out to my brother Kevin yes. Babu. Yeah. Um and also nilikuwa nataka ku showcase the matatu the matatus in wiki and we had that uh kwa the video mm-hmm. uh that was heshma uh kukona staki which tunaongelea uh, zenyewe zikona video yes. so it's heshma and staki, staki. Um, i'm a huge fan of wakadinali mm. and uh na like that they want to make it big without them compromising their style ama ama without them having to go commercial ama to make uh, com- commercial appealing songs mm-hmm. for them to kuwa kwena um, such a big following yeah. so yo kitu you ni inspire sana i'm such a huge fan and um nikasema why not do a song with munga yes. yeah so i featured munga on staki yeah that was staki uh gonna excuse my french mm-hmm. excuse my f- french ni about mimi kujiri introduce you know mm-hmm. i'm just there talking my my shit like hakuna uh, <laughs> <laughs> rapa kona views over 10m yes. you know it's just me reintroducing myself mm-hmm. um gonna the intro which is 17b it's uh, it's just me giving a shout out to mwiki yes and Um, and I'm just talking about this girl Mwenye Ali venture into the music industry mm-hmm. uh, thinking it's all roses you know mm-hmm. and um nikapata vitu ni different kwa ground yeah. but um I I fell in love with music and I knew that's what I wanted to do mm-hmm. so that's the intro yo 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 the bars the bars I am loving it dem kutoka mwiki mm? tell us I want to know the intro Tell us about your intro but before that actually let's talk about the cover art. The cover art. Yes. Um the cover art was done by King Kaka. Mm-hmm. Uh photography was done by Call Me Mina. Okay. The styling was done by Aziza. Yo. Yes. Fire. Fire. You are looking like that bad queen. Thank you. You are <laughs> representing. I love it. Thank you. So here we have this amazing intro. First of all, what event was that? It was Ruga. Ruga. Ah, yeah. Yo, that intro was <laughs> that, fire. That's Combox. That's yeah, yeah, yeah. That's I could tell you Combox. A very like, big shout out to Combox. I was like, yo, what event was this and I was like, I have to ask. Her. Yeah. Who produced that intro? Leon. Uh there's this producer named Leon Vibes. Mm-hmm. Uh he's an upcoming producer but he's he's madly talented, madly. And he actually amefanya kulia kushoto and the intro. Is wow. That good. He is yeah. that good. So yeah. these two songs that we've just heard all from the same producer. Yes, uh, Leon Vibes. Wacha nikuulize. Ukitafuta producer. Yeah. How do you come up with a producer that works for you? Um actually nilienda hiyo studio ya kina Leon. I think I was doing a verse for Trio. Back ni studio ya Trio. Ni home based studio ya Trio. I was doing a verse for Trio. So I went to the studio nikafanya verse. Mm. Uh, nika the producer reached out akaniambia I would really love uh, to work with you nikamwachia namba nikaenda home. Mm. And he actually reached out akanitumia beats. And nilikuwa very impressed nilikuwa like wow you are actually a very good beat maker. Yeah. And Uh, I think mimi ndio msani apart from trio mimi mm. ndio nimempatia opportunity mm. uh, so this is this EP is really it means a lot to him yeah. and uh, because I was impressed by how much he's talented mm. nilikuwa like let's just work uh, on a couple of tracks on this EP yeah. because I would really love to introduce you to the world because na na feel when him when him very talented wacha nikuulize mm. una vibe na beat gani I'm so curious. Um nikifanya EP nilikuwa nafanya purely hip hop. Okay. So nilikuwa na go for tracks that ni hip hop, mm. hip hop uh, old school hip hop, mm-hmm. drill, um drill kind of beats, but kulia kushota ni impressed because na feel ni ni afro beats na hip hop. Na hip hop. Yeah. Yes, I yeah. get those vibes. So nilikuwa very impressed. Nice. Mm. Ikulia kushoto, tell us about how you came up with the lyrics. Kulia kushoto uh, kulia kushoto is just uh, mimi kusema dem de kutoka mwiki, mwiki. badi wa mtani 
uh, kukona lines okay, when you listen to the EP kuna lines na ziko very common in each and every song mm-hmm. which is mnasema Femi one their mom their auntie Femi one na Lea Machali Femi one mama yao kwa hii mziki <laughs> yeah. yeah but also in kulia kushoto na ongelea nafanya mziki nafanya kazi mm. uh, because i feel like i'm really one of the most hard working artists out here mm, say it again yeah <laughs> na niko very consistent very consistent i'm yes. putting in the work mm. um so th- that's me uh, speaking about my professionalism as an artist and also just bragging that i'm from wiki and i'm the best out here mm. yeah tell them <laughs> Now, I feel like you also put Shanti Bobo on. Yes. Moment of silence. Uh, sh- Queen's speech. Let me tell you guys, this song is an anthem to all the women out there. Hmm? Femi. Yeah. Uno. Yes. Let me ask you how This song is a masterpiece. It is. How did you link up with Shanti? Tell me the story. Tell me how it came to being. Um the funny thing actually is to si, meet si, si Shanti. Mm. There's this uh creative director I, I work with mm-hmm. and it was Tony. Mm-hmm. So Tony ndo ali ni link up na Shanti but uh, nimekuwa ni nikiona Shanti on Instagram. Mm. She's there doing her thing and yeah. I'm very impressed. Oh, I met her at Naive Fest. At ah. Naive Fest um ali kama kaniambia yo she would really like to to perform mm-hmm. nipati a chance so before i i did my set yeah. and then nikamuita katikati ya set uh, she actually did her thing nilikuwa nimesahau by the way i'm really sorry mm. yeah she did her thing mm-hmm. and then uh, nikamwambia tuta link up tuta link up mm-hmm. and uh akenda ana 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 record yanga kwa hiyo studio ya kina Leon Vibes mm-hmm. uh, so Leon Vibes sent the beat uh, Shanti akafa akaweka verse yake um, and akaweka part of the chorus and I went and recorded so had to record the same day yeah but uh Queen's Speech ni one of my favorite songs from the EP and mm. it's all about girl power and Shanti Bobo is one of the best MCs out there yeah. na nataka tu wasewa wamsikize manze and if it if all goes well I think it's one of the songs I'll do a video for mm. yeah yeah I was actually going to ask mm. will we get a video because probably let me tell you <laughs> itakuwa moto sana sana I'm curious. Dem mm. gani ungependa kuwak na kwa industry? Ah, uh, kuko na madem wengi sana out there wanna do wanna do so well. Mm-hmm. Uh Brandy Mina she Brandy Yo. Mina is fire. Yeah. Brandy Mina is fire and yes. I always feel like uh Brandy me feel me feel Brandy Mina and Fena they are our banner boy. Mm. Like we can easily export them easily. Yes. Yani they are sound ni their sound is very global that is true yeah, yeah we can we can really easily export wako wako multi talented yeah they can produce they can sing they can mm-hmm. rap na kwanga tu like amazed by the, how much talent, talent. wako nayo yes. yeah so uh, fena brand minor mandy is doing so well mm. saru yes uh, ana put in the work um who else who else Uh, Zinia Manase tumekuwa tukia big conversation for the longest time na Zinia. Yo, let Yo, me Zinia, tell you Z. Zinia, tu tu mangoma. <laughs> We are calling Yama you. Tumekuwa tukiongea for 10 years. It's it's time. Yes. It's time. Uh Karun. Mm. Uh, there's so many so many dope uh, female artists out there. Uh, and na kuanga very me feel fit sana. You know uh, some few years back mm-hmm. kukikuwa na gig Uh, kulikuwa na male artist and then kuko na female yeah, artist yeah. mmoja yeah. but right now like me meet na au madem tuko book the same show na, na feel poor sana oh, na feel yeah. like tuko wawili tuko watatu tuko niko like oh mm. the industry is really growing na wasee wa, wako wana warm up to female artists there's uh, kila mtu anapata a piece of the cake mm-hmm. so na kuanga very 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 proud Yo, yeah i love it mm. and let me tell you all those people you mentioned yeah May you have features with Amen. them. Amen. Yeah. Amen. Now, tulikuwa off air na ukasema kitu kingine and I don't know if I should ask. Mm-hmm. But you said that uh, you might want to steer clear from rapping. Um, no. 
ah uh, si kusema hivyo <laughs> na feel too with the ep na feel i'm um, really in my rapping era in my hip hop era mm-hmm. uh, so from the ep i really don't know what direction right now see you the direction okay. but uh probably i'll go back to doing uh club bangers you know you never Ooh. know uh probably nitaanza kuimba Yeah, R&B. Sasa ndio nilikuwa na ngoja utuambie by the way mimi na talk R&B. Probably so, for the rumba. So you never dope. know from here. So yeah. Yeah. You never know. Dope. So Queen Speech is just one of those songs that I really really love. Thank Together you. with the next one that I'm about to play, Heshma. Yeah. So we're going to play Heshma and then we're going to play Suspect. Okay. Come back, talk about those two songs. And then we're going to finish off with the last 3789. You guys are tuned into the Women Take Over Wednesday show. I am here with Femi Uno as we talk about Dem Kutoka Mwiki. Make sure that you hit us up on all our social media platforms at Radio 254, the only radio station that plays you Kenyan music 24/7. I'll see you.